Hi everyone. Today we will see how you can do IMPS uh, transaction through your HDFC net banking. So uh, log into your net banking and uh, to give a brief on what is IMPS. IMPS is uh, immediate uh, payment service through which you can do immediate payment uh, to any of your beneficiary uh, and this service is available 24 by 7. So uh, coming back to how you can do it. Uh, so lo after logging to your head net banking account in the top menu you can see fund transfer click on that so here uh, the highlighted option uh, is instant transfer or imps uh, transfer so this way uh, you can do imps you have two options being provided one is imps mobile number imps account number we'll see imps account uh, in this video so uh, click on go under instant transfer IMPS account number and uh, just to mention one more thing IMP is available uh, on uh, 365 days that is even on public holidays and uh, uh, weekend holidays as well. So here uh, you have to enter the details that is a step one and you have to confirm the transaction and uh, step three is the acknowledgement. So, uh, from the from account number, enter the enter your account number from which you wish to transfer. Uh, if you have more than one, then you have to select from the drop down, as I have done, and the beneficiary from your beneficiary list. Select uh, your beneficiary. Let me select uh, my other bank account, and uh, then amount I'll enter. Just uh, to show you demo, I'm entering this time HDFC. And yes, I've entered the remarks and I'll click the checkbox. And this is the information that uh, for newly added beneficiary, only rupees 10,000 can be sent in the first 24 hours and 25,000 in the 48 hours. So, this way you can send it and I'll click continue. Now it will show me and ask me for a confirmation just to check everything is fine or not. I cross check and everything is fine then I will click confirm. So an authentication is needed. So uh, there are two ways in which you can authenticate. One is through mobile or email ID. I will check mobile and click continue. Now an OTP will be sent to your mobile this uh, uh, check is there to uh, help transactions be more uh, safe and uh, you know you are you, you get informed about all the transactions happening through your account enter the one time password and click on continue let me do it again i guess i have done uh, i have entered wrong uh, otp i'll uh, start of the process again This time, request for IMPS transfer uh, rupees 10 has been received. This is a user reference number. Thank you for banking with us. Request you to check the transaction status in UIMPS fund transfer. So keep a note of uh, this uh, two numbers. And you can check the status of uh, the IMPS transfer here. In the left side menu, you can see view IMPS fund transfer. Click on that. And we have copied this number slide. Let us paste it. So the amount got debited from my account. I guess I went to oh. Yes, the amount got debited. The amount got credited to my beneficiary account as well. MPS fund transfer is the reference number and then uh, transaction type IMPS. So this is the payment successful. This is the status and if I check I have received SMS to my mobile that amount got uh, credited to the beneficiary account. So this way you can do IMPS fund transfer to HDFC net banking. Hope 
hope uh, this video was helpful if you have any queries related to impf fund transfer of htfs net banking uh, put them through the comment section i'll help you with the information i have thanks for watching have a nice day bye